You're serious? Come on, all I want is a copy of it. No. Don't be like that, Ogawa. It won't cost you anything. I know it wouldn't physically change anything, but I can't shake the feeling that copying the original would take something away from it and make it less magical. Let me borrow it then. Look, I know we're friends, but there's no way that's gonna happen. Why don't you go to a record store and buy it yourself? How am I supposed to find another copy when there's no information about it on the jacket? Where did you even get it from? I'm not saying. <sighs> to be completely honest, Nakayama, that record is more precious to me than my own life. Huh? Where'd it go? You thief! <gasps> I was just borrowing it. You didn't have to hurt me. Yeah, right. You're a liar. Give it back to me right now. That record is everything to me. I'm not letting you steal it just because you want to... I'm sorry, but we haven't carried any analog record players in quite a while. Oh, okay. The only thing I want to do is listen to the haunting music on this record. I finally got it all to myself, but what good is it if I have no way of playing it? Maybe this shop. You want to hear a record you brought in? Yes, please! Even just once would be fine. Hold on. Uh, I recognize that blank jacket. You uh, little thief! That record is part of the permanent collection here! So you're the one who stole it! No, it wasn't me! But you have it! It's the only copy of this song in all of Japan! This record is more important to me than my entire life! Give it back right now! What would you like? An orange juice, please. And, uh... Yes? Is that music from a radio station, or what? No, it's a record player. Well, in that case, uh... Here you go, miss. It's all yours. Thanks so much.
positive. It's the real thing, isn't it? An actual copy of Paula Bell's scat. Do you know anything about this song? It was recorded right after Paula Bell died. You understand what I'm saying, right? She was already dead when she sang this. There's no title on the jacket, but this has to be it. The music has bizarre intonation, and the singing is almost disinterested. I heard rumors of its existence. Now I've heard it. A song from beyond the grave. <laughs> He's going to try and take it from me! Uh, uh, come back! Oh no, I'm... You're not going anywhere. That record's mine. Do you really think you're hiding from me? Huh? What are... Oh god, she's dead! Aristotle. Because of his theories, some people believe that if you whisper in a person's ear while they're sleeping, he will appear in their dreams. There, you can influence the dreamer. Even hurt them if that's what you wish. Psycho. Hey, Psycho. I brought a little present along for you. I don't want anything from you here. Uh, but why not? Kishimoto, you're trying to use Aristotle's method, right? Maybe. I honestly can't believe you'd do that to me. Why didn't you talk to me in person instead of in a dream, you dummy? I'm sorry. I wasn't feeling confident. I don't want to mess things up because I like you so much. In that case, tell me all this again at school tomorrow, in the real world. I will. I promise you. But please, take this for now. <laughs> Look at you two young lovers. And I was already feeling pretty pissed off. Who are you? I guess if you want a name, then call me Jack the Ripper. Now show me your insides. No, don't! <laughs> okay, calm down. It was nothing but a stupid nightmare. Uh, is that the same box from my dream? But there's no ring inside. Later that day, someone found Kishimoto's body in the street, slashed open, butchered. His killer got away. Kishimoto was murdered, and the ring, the one he tried to give me in my dream, disappeared. Was it possible the man from my nightmare killed him? I wasn't sure why, but after that whole Aristotle incident, I had a bad feeling, like something horrible was lurking in my future. Psycho, what is your problem? Don't pretend you're innocent. You guys are acting like a bunch of freaks. I don't know what's gotten into you lately. Please, go on. Explain exactly what we've done that's so odd. You're peeping on me in my room, damn it! I've seen you watching me! And why would we do something so preposterous? We're your family. <sighs> Just stop it, okay? <sighs> New peepholes. This is getting out of control. Bastards. I can't relax for a second. That's enough already! Ugh! What? Really, Mom and Dad? You're not even hiding it anymore! Ugh! Seriously, what is wrong with them? Well, they can't spy on me now. Huh. 
Wait, has someone climbed up on the roof? I won't let them get away with this. Dad, your eye. Is it okay? Just got a bit of a sty, that's all. And is your finger gonna be fine, brother? Sorry I got so mad last night. Why, it's not your fault. I jammed it in PE yesterday. It'll be fine. <laughs> I can't take living in that house any longer. I'm running away for real this time. I know. I'll go to my aunt's place. She'll totally let me stay. Oh, that's strange. There aren't any buses to Kosato. Oh, well, guess I'll walk. What? A dead end? Weird, I thought this was the right street. Uh, another one? doesn't make sense. These buildings shouldn't be here. Maybe I'll try another route. <laughs> the entire main street is blocked off by that building. And why is everyone wearing masks? Is something the matter, miss? You look like you might be lost. Uh, oh, yes. I'm just trying to get to Three Calm in Onishi. I'm actually headed that way myself. Why don't you come with me? Sure, that'd be a big help. buildings stretch on for to the heart of the city your destination in Kosato is practically surrounded by them it's near the center of the construction zone open up damn it is something the matter here the selfish people who live in this house have barricaded the door and refuse to let us in they can't keep us out just smash through tear it down Okay? Thank you so much. You must be from the outside. Does this sort of thing happen a lot around here? It's been worse than usual lately. Everyone's on edge. There are many problems here, but the lack of privacy is the main issue. What do you mean, lack of privacy? Well, you see, all the houses in this town are opened up to public traffic. That means people's homes aren't private anymore. Anyone can walk through them. It's absolutely horrible. And you? What brings you out this way? I wanted to visit my Aunt Tamae. She lives at Three Kom. How can I get there? If you follow the street, you'll come to a river. Cross the bridge and you'll be in Onishi. But it's a dangerous walk. That's the center of town, and if rumors are to be believed, a lot of strange people call that place home. More insanity. There's also a lot of crime in the area, and a serial killer is on the loose. Serial killer? Well, that's all the more reason for me to go find her. In that case, I'd recommend wearing a mask. Thanks. I appreciate it. A 
there's the river. I should be close to her house. This place is so creepy. <gasps> that must be where she lives. Antome! Open the door! It's me, Psycho, your niece! You home? Psycho? It's been so long. The door's open. Come on in. Antome! Ah, oh, look at you, dear. I'm so glad you've come. Um, where are your clothes? <laughs> what can I say? Your aunt still got it, hasn't she? <laughs> I'm amazed you came here alone. I don't know if I would have had the guts at your age. Well, it wasn't exactly the easiest journey, but I was worried about you, so I knew I had to get to you somehow. Why would you be worried? How could I not be with you living in a crazy place like this by yourself? <laughs> What's so funny about that? And why are you sitting there without clothes on? Go get dressed. <laughs> I know you mean well, but just hear me out before you judge, okay? I wasn't sure about any of this at first, either. In fact, when everything started to change, I tried to fight it. I'd lock the house down and hide on the second floor, wrapped in blankets. But people would just smash in the front door or climb up to the roof to peer through the windows into the upper levels. Just look around. There are holes everywhere, from the floor to the ceiling. People were constantly finding ways to peep in. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if someone was looking through them even now. As you can imagine, trying to maintain my privacy through this madness is impossible, so I gave up on it altogether. I accepted the new normal. You can do the same. It's not too late. Come on, Psycho, throw away that mask and take off your clothes, darling. It's like shedding your skin. You don't talk like the same person I remember. Didn't you hear what I just said? You are looking at a new woman. That's insane. No, you're the insane one. Hey, how's it going? Hey. Oh, never mind. How about an apple? Their skin slips off easily, too. Aunt Tame, you're acting really weird. I don't think living here is good for you. Your brain is all messed up. And I heard there's a serial killer around here, too. You can say you don't need your privacy, but I think living without it has made you lose your mind. You don't understand anything, you little brat. You're just a child, so stop yapping and take off your clothes. If you won't, I'll slice them off you myself. I'll cut you to pieces. Antomay, stop! Hold it! Hurry, somebody catch that little bitch! <laughs> the young lady from before. I was worried you might have gotten lost in the streets again. Help! You gotta get me out of this place, please! All I want is to be at home in my room! Sure, all right then. Come on, you can follow me out of here. We're back to the water. <laughs> Look there. The illegal constructions were built over the river, too. Isn't it wild? Hey, I know that ring. Is there something about it that interests you? Here, allow me to give it to you as a gift. Well, isn't that odd? The ring fits you perfectly. I have to admit, I feel like I've met you before somewhere. Tell me, miss, do you happen to remember me? Jack the Ripper! You murdered Kishimoto, didn't you? That's right. Why did you kill him? You should be grateful to your boyfriend, you know. If he hadn't been there, I would have sliced you open instead. <laughs> but we can still play now. <laughs>
Follow the river upstream. You'll be out of here soon, dear. Come with me. We can go together. Antomae!